If you want to make some picks on your favorite sports, check out Underdog Fantasy's Pick'em Game, where you choose higher or lower on between two to eight players and can win up to 325 times your entry. And using code Zerk when you sign up, you'll get up to $1,000 in bonus cash and a free pick. The whole thing wobbing. So I've been holding on to my training points from the Tyree kill glitch. We're going to use them today on mystery packs. Now, I do want to give a shout out to SS Germ for being a part of the Nodi gang. If you guys want a chance to shout out in the next video, drop a link in the vid. Make sure you guys are subbed to the channel. Notification bell on. Comment down below. Nodi gang. Also, I do want to say shout out to you guys who have been copying my NFL picks this season. We have been dominating with the NFL. Last night, Papa Z absolutely carried, though. He had over $1,300 in wins. Which, by the way, you can get on my dad's picks on Twitter as well. But he had a monster, monster night. We about broke even. But we we have all of these picks going into Sunday that just need one thing to hit on them. So overall, pretty good night. And if you guys check out Underdog Fantasy right now using code ZERK, you'll get up to $1,000 in bonus funds. You'll get this Lamar Jackson 0.5 yards free pick for Sunday. And you guys will get this Patrick Mahomes 0.5 yards free pick as well. Like I said, we have a ton of profit boosters today. There's discounts this weekend. There's something every single day on Underdog throughout September. Today, guys, we have a bunch of profit boosters. I personally have seven to use. I'll be tweeting those out later. Now, in case you guys don't know about the glitch, you must not follow me over on Twitter, which you definitely need to. And I also post a video on it but there was a glitch that was going on where there was a solo that was not supposed to be here that we could go through play the solo challenge and when you guys played the solo you would end up getting this 92 overall Tyree kill then you just kept going back into the solo backing out backing out backing out and you just kept getting unlimited Tyree kills so essentially I was quick selling all these 92 Tyreeks that is how I have 11 thousand training points which as of right now is about half a million coins worth that being said i've been waiting to use them either on uh the 80 plus overall breakouts when breakouts drop today or mystery packs so i'm gonna go ahead and do mystery i guess yesterday with the breakouts i am recording this video here pretty early on a uh, friday morning that being said let's get into it now i do want to let you guys know mystery packs yesterday man these packs were so so glitched in case you don't know there was a lot going on with them number one uh packs that you opened up like sometimes you would open them up and it would take your training points you wouldn't get anything if that happened to you download the madden companion app okay go on the madden companion app again follow me over on twitter i talked about this like hours ago go on the madden companion app and go to your packs you'll be able to see the packs in there they're just all campus hero packs for some reason that pack i guess in particular was glitch yesterday uh then sometimes you would open up like a mystery pack here doesn't matter what pack you would get you would open it up and then it would give you cards that you have personally in your item binder that like you just recently added then i was getting like 82 plus overall bnd breakouts 80 plus overall breakouts uh it was it was weird okay it was definitely just really really weird i'm just gonna let you guys know right now i'm gonna quick sell a lot of these cards here we're gonna keep these though those are pretty solid value obviously the 79 overall akas they go for a decent bit so we're just gonna see how many coins can we make today by the way in terms of content today is friday so yeah no uh no content over here in uh, madden the ultimate team do we get a champion 87 amon ross st brown let's go 250k as i said we have about 500,000 coins basically worth of training here we just got a 250k poll all right so that's a great start to the pack opening we will definitely take that but no content today uh it is friday we do have legends tomorrow we should see those reveals tonight around 7 p.m eastern time obviously we kind of already know who they are because of mutt leaks right leaking who they are going to be as you get a legend right there 80 overall ken houston again and i'm gonna quick sell a lot of the gold cards that way i just don't have to go through and sell them i know it's probably best in terms of value to uh go ahead and you know actually just sell the cards but is what it is russian pack right here we're going to again quick sell everything oh we do have content over on college ultimate team for those of you guys that follow me over on my college ultimate team channel i'm probably gonna post this video like right before hopping into that stream gotta say i'm actually really excited for uh the content over there today it's the homecoming promo which i don't really know exactly what it is but I do know that you can get a free Jamar Chase, Joe Burrow, or a Justin Jefferson. So pretty awesome stuff there. I think they're 89 overall champions. Yeah, you can literally get one of them for completely free. So hopefully College Ultimate Team, you know, picks it up a little bit. I'll tell you guys right now, if you don't play College Ultimate Team and you're only over here playing Madden Ultimate Team, you got it good to be honest because I'm going to keep it a buck. 
it has not been great over there on college ultimate team as of late it, it truly truly has not the amount of content they've been getting over there uh and also all the delays everything you would you would be shocked okay you would definitely be shocked as you get 80 overall jeff okuda right there i'll save the campus heroes even though uh one of those right there was only a 78 overall is what it is 70 plus don't want to see that definitely don't want to see that i gotta tell you guys what though season three is coming up for madden ultimate team obviously you guys see i'm season level 39 i've done i think almost every single objective that i possibly could so i'm very very close to being like the top level you could possibly be there might be some of you guys out there that are already over 40 uh, i have to do my daily objective today here very shortly as do 80 overall jonathan taylor right there uh, and i think there's like one more objective i think it's team tackles i think i also might need to get interceptions actually so there's a little bit more xp that i could possibly get i think i might have missed like one daily i believe so if some of you guys out there are like 41 right now i think that might be the max you can get to but season three is coming up and i gotta say it looks like it's gonna be really really heavily focused around most fear we already saw the season three card art as the 83 overall kieran williams definitely take that uh but we already saw like the season three animation from mutt leaks again and it is very very centered around most feared which i you know like most feared every year it kind of depends how good ea wants to make it to be honest there's years where most feared comes the halloween promo for those of you guys that didn't ever play madden ultimate team uh and some years it's really good some years it's really good other years it's kind of you know lackluster for sure uh and when it does come to the most fear promo it's not necessarily going to be as crazy as it was in like years past why are we getting so many campus hero packs we are getting so so many campus hero packs i'll take the 83 overall kieran williams though if you want to keep throwing me those definitely we'll take uh all the coins we can get from those kirans all right not a campus hero thank you very much there we actually used to get some crazy crazy stuff going on with the most feared promo for those guys that didn't play madden in like madden 16 15 whatever around those times yeah it would get crazy like the players would be like nine feet tall for like three days it was it was absolutely insane they'd be like crazy juiced up des bryant was like nine feet tall gronkowski uh brian dawkins marshawn lynch those were the good days of most feared it's it's not really as crazy as that anymore but who knows maybe ea will go back to that let us have a little bit of fun uh but in general i do think it's going to be pretty good right hopefully a pretty good promo and honestly that could be coming up here very very soon we are about to head into october we got the breakouts part two here today uh we don't exactly know what the or yesterday we don't exactly know what the next promo is going to be for ea but i will say i think we've got some pretty good stuff coming so season two overall you know i feel like it was pretty good I, I think the game time promo in my opinion i liked a lot of the cards we got there breakouts promo i really really like the breakouts promo. if you guys did not already see by the way over on xerxy 2 uh my second channel i just posted a gameplay over there yesterday with will levis will levis is quarterback one all right i know a lot of you guys out there like trevor lawrence which is understandable right t law that's a very very good card uh, a lot a lot of people like cj stroud a lot of people like a lot of other quarterbacks in this game jordan love the aaron Rodgers team of the week so many other qbs michael vick whoever you currently are rocking out with but i'll tell you right now i've used a lot of the quarterbacks i'm saying will levis is qb1 in my personal opinion the release that he has is absolutely insane by the way he actually has like a pretty good acceleration as rico dowdle right there oh my i didn't even talk about the beat down we just laid on the giants last night come on was there ever any doubt rico dowdle touchdown i told you guys cd lamb touchdown i told you as we get 83 overall quay walker nice pull i told you cd lamb touchdown i told you daniel jones was throwing a pick i absolutely called that okay absolutely called that we get a pro ace fantasy this could be pretty good right here uh but will levis yeah in my personal opinion i think he's quarterback one and not just because of the very fast release that is really really good and obviously why he is with gunslinger as the 82 overall cj ham 84 robert spillane okay we'll take that we've been quietly getting actually pretty solid pulls in the background here a couple 83s 84s it's all adding up right all the coins they are all adding up here uh but as i was saying will levis he actually has like very very sneaky quick speed his acceleration i believe is like an 87 i want to say somewhere around there like 87 and then i actually have a little bit of titans chemistry on my team so i personally got him up even one more excel and i'll tell you right now he is like 
very quick. When you hold to sprint, right, to get out of the pocket, he's really, really quick. Now, of course, his top speed is not like 90. It's not, you know, 85, 86 even. It's only 80 when you guys go ahead and add on that breakout badge. But I still think that is good enough, in my personal opinion, as a couple of elites. We'll take that. Daniel Jones, welcome uh, once again to the Cowboys loss column right there. Understandable. We'll catch you uh, later this season as well, by the way, to uh, give him another one. Malik Neighbors definitely had a crazy, crazy game last night, though. I'll tell you that. Hopefully, he's okay. Same thing with Micah Parsons. Man, I was I was pretty mad when uh, Micah got carted off. I heard it's just a sprain, so we'll see about that. But I'll tell you right now, I was I was not happy. Uh, we do get a quick sell card. I'll quick sell that. Coming down to the last couple of packs, though, guys, we have 2,600 training remaining. I'll, I'll be honest, I think because of the Amon Ross St. Brown poll and all these 83s, all these 80s, whatever we've been getting, in my opinion, I think we made over 500,000 coins, okay? I know a lot of people kind of warned me over on Twitter about doing this pack opening here because they've been getting a lot of get -a golds or in general, their packs haven't been good. But hey, we actually ended up getting a pretty good pull with the Almond Raw and just a lot of these 83 overalls and 82s, whatever, even an 84 overall pull as well. Uh, I'm trying to pull another 83 so I can uh, double check on the price, but not exactly sure what the 83s are going for. But we have a lot of them. We definitely have a lot of these 83s. Don't want to see the get -a golds and I just realized, by the way, um, are Core Elite Packs in this? Yeah, uh, no. Okay, so Core Elite Packs are not. Action Elite Packs, though, are. I have not pulled an Action Elite Pack. That'd be awesome if we could. As you get 80 overall right there, we'll take that. Down to what could be the final three packs here, unless we get like a pro rushing or a rushing, I'll likely quick sell. Uh, majority of the cards there. Game time pack right here. We get 80 overall, Jared Stinham. 700 training points left down to the final couple of packs. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video though. This was definitely a, a nice little chat this morning. Nice little chat here. And also good little use of the training points, right? Definitely made a decent amount of coins. Wish I would've got an LTD poll, but you know, is what it is that being said hopefully you guys enjoyed the video drop a like on it hit that sub button down below get an 84 overall alvin kamara all right how much are these 84s uh going for here 40k all right i mean honestly between all the 84s the 83s the 80s whatever i definitely feel like we made over half a million coins including the Amon Ross St. Brown. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like on it. Hit that sub button down below. Make sure to check out Underdog Fantasy. Use code Zerk. Follow me over on Twitter for my picks. Like I said, I have a lot of profit boosters to use today, okay? I have a ton. I'm going to have picks for that. UFC, college football tomorrow, NFL on Sunday. Follow my Twitter. I'm going to post college football for tonight as well. I do believe we have a game, so I have picks for that. College football tomorrow, UFC, NFL, whole lot of stuff going on. If you guys enjoyed this video, check out these.